there everyone, today I will be making lemon tarts. So we will start with the short crust pastry. We will be needing 200 grams of flour, 100 grams of butter, cold and cut in cubes, 50 grams of powdered sugar. Whisk both the flour and sugar till combined. And then add the butter and mix it in by what is called the rub in method. So when the butter is combined with the flour, it will form a sandy or breadcrumb like mixture. Then add in 1.5 tablespoons of chilled water and mix. Do not knead it for too long, just enough so it forms a dough. Once done, cling wrap the dough and refrigerate it for 30 minutes or even overnight. Now for the lemon curd, rather lime, as we don't have lemons here, you'll need 100 grams of sugar, 40 grams of butter, cold, juice of 2 limes, and the zest as well. And two eggs. Mix the sugar and egg until lightly foamy. This is a very simple recipe as we will be using the microwave to cook the lemon curd rather than the stove. Then add the lime juice and the zest as well and mix. Now put it in the microwave for 30 seconds and then whisk. Continue doing this at 30 second intervals till it becomes thick. I did it for almost 2 minutes. Don't worry if it looks curdled, just keep whisking it well. If your lemon curd does get curdled, just pass it through a sieve or a strainer so it's smooth again. You'll know it's done when it coats the back of a spoon and you can draw a line. Add the butter gradually and whisk. Keep your lemon curd aside to let it cool. Now back to the short crust. Take your dough out 5 to 10 minutes before rolling it out. Generously flour before rolling it. Keep adding flour to the bottom so it doesn't stick. then cut it with a round cutter. I will be using small tart shells but you can use a muffin tray as well. Just make sure you cut the circles slightly larger than the muffin mold. Collect all the trimmings and make into a ball of dough again and refrigerate it till you roll out again. Press the dough lightly against the mold like so and trim off the edges. Then fill them with some sort of beans so they weigh down the pastry and it won't puff up while baking. I've used kidney beans here.
and bake at 160 degrees Celsius for 15 to 20 minutes. Make sure to rotate the tray halfway through for even color. Once done, remove the beans and let the tarts cool. And then fill with the curd and they're ready to serve.